Okay, I've been challenged to play the binary game. You can find this game on the Cisco Learning Network. And the idea is to convert binary to decimal and decimal to binary numbers. You'll see how it is once I hit play game. But it's a really fun way to test your binary math skills. And this is certainly something that you need as a network engineer and especially if you're preparing for a certification exam such as CCNA. But without further ado, let's just hit play game and see how it goes. All right, I'm going to turn the sound off actually, so it's not going to bother us. So the idea is that uh, you have a number here and now you need to find the binary equivalent. And at the lower levels, you have these guides here at the bottom that will help you greatly. But once you get to level three or so, they will disappear and you're on your own. And also, if you see the binary positions already, then you need to figure out what decimal number it co corresponds to. So here we have nine. Uh, that's a little bit tricky, but if you know subnet masks, you know that it's 148 or 248, I should say. Uh, see, at the beginning, the numbers are fairly easy. And if you know binary, you should be able to complete them pretty quickly, but it gets difficult at the higher levels, even here on the second level or so, like you're, you're going to be challenged. So let's see, how many do we have left? Oh, that was the last one for level one. So now level one is complete. So let's just move on to level two right away and see how that goes. Okay. So far, so good. I think you get extra points if you are able to clear the board. So if you're fast enough, you can earn some extra points. All right, let's see here. Uh, 64. Okay. Sometimes you might have to strategize a little bit if you get more difficult numbers. But the game ends if you, if the board gets full and you're unable to do the number conversions, you get a game over. So you don't have so much time to think. And one other thing, um, I can show you shortly. Oh, we completed level two. All right. Let's just go to the next one. I think this is the last one where you still have the guides. Uh, 248 and you see the numbers keep repeating as well. You get many of the same numbers again and again. Uh, now I'm struggling a little bit. That is going to be 80 and here. So you see, if I do pause, the numbers are going to disappear. So you won't be able to pull out a calculator and see what numbers you're supposed to be converting. So you need to know your binary numbers. Here we go. Board cleared. How many lines do we got left? 14. All right. Let's see if we can get to the next level and you'll see how the guides are gonna disappear. Uh, I'm struggling again. Is that going to be, uh, no, that's, that's going to be wrong. But see here, now I don't immediately know what to do with that. So I can do another number and give myself some more time to think about that one. And actually I think I was off by 10. Yes. Okay, we have a few more lines, and then this level is complete. Uh, three more. Okay. 
Here we go. Now you see it even gives you a warning that the guide numbers are going to disappear. They will be deactivated from now on. So here's where you'll be really tested. Let's try it. Let's see how far we can go. Let's try it for a few lines at least. Uh, 46 uh, or sorry, 45. Oh, no, I'm messing up that one. See, now it's way more difficult because you don't see the guides here anymore. I think this is 25. Uh, this is going to be 131. I think this is 60. So you see, this one seems difficult for me, so I'm, I'm leaving it here for a little bit and trying to... <laughs> Yeah. avoid uh, that number you can do that but not infinitely so it, it's a it's a bit tricky if you uh, take that approach okay what do we got here then <laughs> see already it's uh, getting challenging and especially while I'm trying to talk at the same time uh, it's a little bit difficult uh, so hold on. So we got, I think this is going to be 54. Okay, 20. Um, uh, sorry, I'm this way. Okay, I'll do a few more lines and then I'll let the board fill up so you see what happens when the game is finished. So let's see. So here we have 20. All right, let's make this the last one. So now I'll just let it run. You'll see that the board will be filled with numbers. And I'm getting distracted because I want to solve the numbers. Um, but yeah, I think the... As you move to higher levels, uh, there will be even less time to convert the numbers. And here, actually, next, you should see that it's going to start blinking and it's going to give you kind of a warning that you're running out of time, like that. So here you can uh, still try to save yourself um, by completing these numbers quickly, but it's not very forgiving. All right, let's let it the timer run out. So here we go, game over. And uh, I already played one game before, so you can see my previous score from there. But yeah, that's how you play the binary game. I challenge you to play it and have fun. Let me know your scores. Uh, let's see if we can get a little bit of a competition going and maybe a leaderboard activated again. All right, have fun with the binary game.